When discussing what angels actually look like according to the Bible, it's essential to understand that the descriptions provided are often far from the common portrayal of angels as human-like figures with white robes and wings. The Bible presents angels in various forms, each serving different purposes and conveying different aspects of their nature and God's message. In this video, we will focus on the most detailed descriptions found in the Bible, emphasizing the diversity and complexity of angelic appearances. First, it's important to note that the Bible does not always provide detailed physical descriptions of angels. However, when it does, the imagery can be surprising and complex. Angels are heavenly beings created by God, serving as messengers, warriors, and servants of God's will. Their appearance often reflects their purpose or the nature of the message they are conveying. One of the most detailed descriptions is found in the book of Ezekiel, where the prophet Ezekiel describes his vision of four living creatures in Ezekiel chapter 1 verses 5 to 14. These beings, later interpreted by many scholars as cherubim, are described as having four faces each, the face of a human, a lion, an ox, and an eagle. They each have four wings, with their legs straight and the soles of their feet like the sole of a calf's foot, and they sparkle like burnished bronze. These creatures also had the hands of a human under their wings on their four sides, and they moved in the direction of any of their faces, without turning as they moved. This imagery is rich and complex, suggesting a being that transcends ordinary physical forms and is capable of moving through the heavens with ease and authority. Another detailed account is found in the book of Revelation, where the Apostle John provides a description of seraphim in Revelation chapter 4 verses 6 to 8. These beings are around the throne of God and are covered with eyes in front and behind. Each of the seraphim has six wings, with two they covered their faces, with two they covered their feet, and with two they were flying. They continuously proclaim the holiness of God. The presence of eyes all around and the six wings suggest a state of constant vigilance and readiness to serve God. Furthermore, the book of Daniel offers a glimpse into the appearance of an angel in Daniel chapter 10 verses 5 to 6. Daniel describes seeing a man dressed in linen, with a belt of the finest gold around his waist. His body was like chrysolite, his face like lightning, his eyes like flaming torches, his arms and legs like the gleam of burnished bronze, and his voice like the sound of a multitude. This description emphasizes the majesty and awe-inspiring presence of the angel, reflecting the glory and power of God. It's also worth mentioning that not all biblical angelic appearances are so otherworldly. Sometimes, angels appear in human form, indistinguishable from ordinary people. This is seen in several stories where angels visit Abraham, Lot, and other figures in the Bible, often to deliver messages or guidance from God. These instances show that angels can choose to appear in a way that is comprehensible and approachable to humans, serving their role as messengers between God and people. The diversity in angelic appearances within the Bible underscores the multifaceted roles that angels play in the biblical narrative. Their appearances are symbolic, reflecting their divine mission and the majesty of God whom they serve. When angels appear as awe-inspiring beings with multiple faces, wings, and eyes, it emphasizes their supernatural nature and the grandeur of their Creator. When they appear as humans, it shows their role as messengers and protectors in a form that is accessible to those they are sent to guide or warn. The biblical descriptions of angels challenge the common, simplified images we often see. Angels in the Bible are not merely human-like figures with wings, they are complex, multifaceted beings whose appearances can vary dramatically. From the four-faced, four-winged creatures of Ezekiel's vision to the serene, human-like messengers who visit Abraham and Lot, angels are depicted in ways that underscore their divine origin and the vastness of their roles in the heavenly realm. These descriptions invite readers to expand their understanding of the divine and the myriad ways in which it intersects with the human world.